The A320 family has three independent hydraulic systems. Green, yellow, blue. The green and yellow hydraulic systems are each pressurized by an engine-driven pump. The yellow hydraulic system can also be pressurized by an electric pump. A power transfer unit enables the green system to be pressurized by the yellow system and vice versa. The PTU is designed to power a hydraulic system in case of pump failure. It is not designed to be used when the hydraulic system has a fault, such as an overheat, low reservoir, or low air pressure. In addition, the PTU is inhibited from operating, one, when the parking brake is on, and only one engine master switch is on. Two, when the parking brake is off, nose wheel is deactivated, and only one engine master switch is on. 3. When the cargo doors are being operated. And 4. When the PTU switch is off. Fire shutoff valves are located between the reservoirs and the engine driven pumps. The blue hydraulic system is pressurized by an electric pump. In an emergency, the blue system can be pressurized by the ram air turbine, the RAT. Each hydraulic system delivers a constant pressure to the users. All the components we have talked about are displayed on the ECAM hydraulic page. Let's briefly review the basic system using the ECAM hydraulic page. The reservoirs, the fire shutoff valves, the pumps, the rat, the PTU, the pressure indications. The controls for the components that we have introduced are located on the overhead hydraulic control panel. Let's now go to the ECAM hydraulic page together with the hydraulic control panel. The hydraulic system is fully automatic. However, each pump and the PTU have an associated push button switch for abnormal operation. Each hydraulic engine pump is controlled by a push button switch located on the overhead panel. Each hydraulic electrical pump is controlled by a push button switch. The PTU is controlled by a push button switch. The rat may be extended manually by using this guarded push-button switch.